a tank. It's uh, paid fifty dollars for this of Ace Hardware, and we're gonna drill the hole right here. So we already started it right between here and here in the middle. So I'm just gonna uh, keep drilling until it's uh, twelve millimeters wide. I'm going to put plenty of uh, Teflon tape on there because this has to seal by itself when I when I put this one on there because uh, the inside of this might not be smooth so it's not going to seal uh, this is going to have to seal here so I put plenty of Teflon as you see here the end of this hose I cut it like a fish mouth so if it goes all the way down there and it uh, touches the sides or the bottom it doesn't get blocked up this way you can still uh, pull in gas so now we're going to put that in there this is the tricky part That's on. So now I will grab that from inside. Okay, that's nice and tight. Now we're adding the final piece. It's a valve with a nozzle here. Just put that in here and it's done. Okay, and it is done now. Uh, the nicest thing about this setup is you can disconnect this here and just take the jerry can to the gas station and get gas and come back with it. You can use it as a normal jerry can. Uh, it doesn't have to stay attached to the generator all the time. Here's another one I made before. And as you see, it's exactly the same setup. And there's a quick release here. So this is where I disconnect these when I fill up and as you see also there is a fuel filter here which today I'm gonna change it's been on there for about two months and another quick release here on the generator side 